Hey guys, welcome back. So I thought I would do a video showing you the um, scrapbook paper. I mentioned when I did my journal haul that I had purchased some scrapbook paper also and I just hadn't gotten around to filming it yet because the paper pads are so big it's kind of awkward and then today I was like you know what I'm just going to show it um, so I can get it put away and I have a couple other things to show you guys too um, and it, I'm not going to be able to show the whole I don't know how good the angle is going to be on those paper pads because I was going to film it on my bed so I'd have more room and my cat is sleeping in her cat bed and she looks so cozy. I can't move her, you guys. I know that sounds terrible. But she's all curled up in a ball with her little head. I would show you if I didn't have other stuff piled up on my bed right now around her to make a mess. But um, she looks really cute. And I just, I can't do that to her. <laughs> so I'll do the best I can do. Um, I did pick up yesterday. We went to the Dollar Tree. We, we needed to get some um, cleaning supplies. And a lot of times we'll stock up on those... Um, at the dollar store, uh, um, you know, just random, like our bleach cleaner and stuff like that. We'll just get that there. So we stopped to the dollar store and I looked in their, um, craft section and I always go through like their little art supplies or whatever. And I found these ribbons and I thought they were so, so pretty. Um, so the first one, of course these caught my eye. They're like metallic and it's kind of like a coral, uh, chevron print. I don't know if my white might be washing it out, but um, I just thought that was so pretty. And I was like, how could I resist that? You know, it's so springish and everything. So I grabbed one of those because I thought that would be um, super pretty. And then I had, they had a teal or like, yeah, like an aqua color also with the metallic gold um, print on it. And then they had purple and then they had like a tan also. So they had four different shades of that. So check your Dollar Tree. And these are um, three yards, 2.74 meters. And I, you know, I didn't really know what I would use it for, but I thought maybe in journaling or in my coloring pages, I could find a use for it because it was just so pretty and spring, you know. And then they had, they had a whole bunch, they had sequined too, but I didn't get any of the sequin. But then they had this one, which is nine feet, um, and it's pink or purple glitter. And I liked that the glitters on it were like blue and green. Uh, you know, I just really like that. And then I grabbed also a pink one. And then I think they had, um, light blue and maybe yellow too of the glitter ribbon. So... I thought that was really pretty. Again, I don't know if my light is washing it out. It probably is, but I thought those were cute for a buck piece. Score. And then it's so funny because after I did my journal haul, I was moving some stuff around and I came across this, you guys. I already had a journal that I didn't even, like I knew I had it, but I guess I forgot. Um, it's a Wonder Woman's journal and it's like the holographic. There we go. See, there she goes. You gotta turn it up and down. So she goes from Diana Prince to Wonder Woman. Wonder Woman. <laughs> so yeah, and it's from um I can't read that. It's too small. But it's let me see if it, on the back it's got the Wonder Woman logo. And it's uh on the inside this journal belongs to, and then all the pages are lined with red dots and they have the Wonder Woman at the bottom of them and then also over here at the top with the with the red and blue stars really super super cute little journal I forgot I had this so um oh yeah and they go there's different pictures of her too so like here's that one and I think yeah there she is with her lariat there she is flying so neat so I put that in with my other journals and then when on Valentine's Day when Keith and I were out we went out to dinner um to Longhorn Steakhouse and then we went to uh what's that place called Barnes and Noble <laughs> and I picked up this journal he said well get whatever you want and I really didn't see I was hoping that they would have the um Momo Girl issue of Coloring Heaven over there, but they still had that Dragons one, Dragons in Nature or whatever, and I was interested in that, so that was kind of a bummer. But I saw this journal, and it's metallic. 
Um, I'm not really into peacocks, but the I loved the metallic blue on this. The foiling, I just thought it was really, really, really pretty. So I grabbed it, and it was $6.98, and it's like got that kind of faux leather type cover. Um, the inside is just blue, and the pages are lined, and it has a blue bookmark in there. So I thought that was really pretty. And yeah, so it was $6.98. And I thought that was really, they have a really nice selection of journals over there. I was looking, there was one of those ones that's fake leather. And it was um, like, it's got Starry Night on it. And it's got those leather ties on it. I really want that. I think it was like $40, but I don't need it now. I got enough journals. So I'm going to show you the scrapbook paper that I got. Um, and I'm not really into scrapbooking. So these, I don't know anything about scrapbook paper. I buy it because it's pretty. And it appeals to me and I cut it up and I use it for different things, mostly in coloring, but I, you know, other things too. Um, and I'm going to use it in my journaling. So I was shopping on Michael's the night that I placed my journal order and my massive journal order. And they had the hot buy pads, um, were $4.99 and then they were an extra 20% off. So I think they were $4.29. So I bought five of them. So I'm going to do my best to show you what they look like. Um, so you can see this fits, this fits in here. Good. Okay. So this one is the dark rainbow and I really, really liked this. It's kind of witchy. It's like cosmic and, um, celestial and I liked it cause I've never seen anything like it before. So, um, I'm not going to flip through like every page or anything, but just show you like a general idea. Here's the page with like the cutouts. Let me see. Do I need to move it over this way a little bit? There we go. I like the holographic, um, and you get like two pages of everything, I think is how it goes. So I thought that was pretty neat, you know. Here's just some regular purple. Um, this is pretty with roses on it. I don't know if you can, how good you can see. I don't want to wash anything out, but I, it's really dingy outside, so... Um, I like these cutouts. I like these a lot, so I thought that would be nice to have um, to definitely use. Another holograph page. Some crystals, which I'm not into crystals, but still it's cool. Um, I thought it would look cool on like my with my Gypsy Dancer Deborah Muller pages to, to do that. So, so yeah, just um, this one has a Zodiac on it. Just kind of giving you guys a general idea. Nothing exciting there. This has like those hands with crystals and uh, some flowers. Some more. Uh, what's it called? Holographic? That's got some zodiac on it. This one's pretty neat. You are destined for great things. And this has like the moth and then the moon. So pretty neat there. So that one is the, sorry, my hands are awkward with this kind of stuff. So this one is the dark rainbow paper pad from Recollections at Michael's. All right, I'm going to move that out of the way and then I will get the next one to show you. The next one is Parisian Love. This one is really pretty too. It's like really girly. You know me, I'm really girly. <laughs> so there's that. How is it possible that I already got a paper cut, you guys? Look how cute these are. I'm not perfect, but my makeup is. Love that. Um, bonjour, cheers, c'est la vie, ooh la la. Like the one with the glasses. Um... I'm not too into like the whole Parisian scene, like the Eiffel Tower and things like that. I have no desire to go visit France, <laughs> but um, I do. I do like the fashion and and um, things like that. So, so I thought that would be neat. Love this. This is like a foiled page. We got some dots here. This one. Uh, just wake up and make up. Bonjour. Happiness and those shoes look great on you. Um, I'm not perfect, but my makeup is. You and me, we eat, drink, and go to Paris. Um, C'est la vie, gorgeous. 
So things like that. I just love pretty paper. That's my problem. Here's some cutouts. Happiness and those shoes look great on you. You're so sweet. I like the perfume bottle. I like this one with the polka dots too. And the, the eyelashes up here at the top. Really nice. I love this print with the lashes and the shoes and the sunglasses and uh, the lips, makeup. I bought some stickers from Etsy and they will be coming in soon. Lash print. Um, I'll really show those. They look like they're going to be really, really cute. Bicycle and people. There's some stripes. Some polka dots. I love polka dots. More floral. Let's see. Floral. And then say lovey. So that is the ugh, Parisian love. Okay. So let me get the next one. This one is called Spring Posies Bouquet. Isn't that so pretty? Oh, it's just so pretty. Make today beautiful. I would frame this and just hang it up like that. I love it. I love the green. I love green. I love green and pink together. So this, I found these. And these are, these are already falling apart. <laughs> I need to get like a thing to put my papers in. If you're a green lover, this would really definitely appeal to you. There's a lot of green in here. It's so gorgeous. I'm trying to make sure these are in frame good for you. There's the cutouts on this one. I like the little bunny rabbit with the flowers on it. Really, really cute. And this one has the silhouette of the bunny. Have yourself a good time. Look at the butterflies. Just one they make such a cute background for like a coloring page if you cut out like the central figure of like a big butterfly or like a girl or some kind of flower or something. I like that. Like I said, and I don't scrapbook, but I, I really enjoy the papers, you know. beauty in everything. Some butterflies on pink paper. I think that's the end of that one. So let me grab the next one. There's just two more. This one is called Bold Brush Strokes. I like this one a lot too. This one is, suits my oh, my invoices in here. Let me get that out. This one suits my personality because it's very bright. I really, really like that. It just appeals to me. I mean, for $4.29, you guys, how could I not get these papers? <laughs> I mean, seriously, how could I not get them? Well, I guess I didn't have to, but, you know. That one's really pretty. This one's really pretty. Look at that. Trying to make sure I don't skip one. There's the cutout 
for that one. That's pretty. And then this one is the last to there. So that is the bold brush strokes. And then I've got one more. This one is called Newport Grove. It's a lot of blue. So if you like blue, this one would be good for you. And I already have used this. I've already cut uh, one of the cutaways out. Make sure I'm in frame here. That one's coming apart too. Oops. Yep. There they are coming apart. That's okay. So this is pretty with the foiling. It's pretty with the light blue. And then this has just some lines on it. And that is like that. Alright, I'm going to flip this up and see. Maybe they won't flip out now. So here's those cutaways. Oh, they're stuck together. Oh, that's pretty. That's really pretty. And there's that. With the bird on it. That's nice. together. So here's uh, the cutaways for there. I like this one, Stay Bright. I, yeah, I cut out one of these. It's up to you. So I cut it uh, out of this page already. Uh, and using it in my, my journal, I used it the other day. So... That's, oh, isn't that pretty? Look how pretty that is. Oh, it's just gorgeous. And it looks like it's wrinkled or something, but it's not. That's just in the pattern. Go where you feel most alive. That's nice. That's just some lines. Some more cutaways. Decide to rise. Find your wild. It does matter. Take the risks. Her soul is fierce. Her heart is brave. Her mind is strong. Be bright. See the good. Cherish it. See, I really like those. It's so pretty. All of it's so pretty. This reminds me of a dress that you would wear on vacation in Bali. <laughs> Not that I've ever been on vacation in Bali before, but if I did, I would wear that dress. We just have a couple more. Ooh, look at the fans. It looks like stained glass, doesn't it? And it's metallic. Look how pretty that is. And then that is the last one. So that is the... Oh, the pages are falling out. That is the Newport Grove. So yeah, I was like, I mean, I've had these hot buy papers before. I have a um, mermaid themed one that I got um, to work with in my Deborah Miller Mermaid Soul journal. I got specifically for using that. And then um, I also have a Halloween themed one too, but I, I think I'm pretty well set now. I don't need to get any more. And then the last thing I got, I picked up today, 
I had to go to CVS and get some Flonase because my I had a prescription for nasal spray, which I'm sure you guys are like, why is she telling us this? Just because I'm chatty. <laughs> I had a prescription for nasal spray uh, two years ago. I got it for my doctor and I finally just ran out of it this morning um, and I use it for my allergies here and there, but it lasted me for two years and um, I needed I needed a refill on it and I didn't want to go to the doctor. So I Googled it to see what it was. Lo and behold, it's Flonase. I had no idea. Shows you how into my medicines I am. I am. So I got the, um, I went to CVS and got some, some of their brand of Flonase and hopefully it'll work. But they had these, you guys. Reese's, or, or no, not Reese's, M&M peanut butter eggs. And they are delicious. I love peanut butter M&Ms anyways. They're my favorite. But seriously, you guys, look how big those are. They're like Whoppers. They're jumbo and they're delicious. I'm going to eat this one. Okay. That's it. I just wanted to show you guys what I got. So, um, that's all just a little haul, but I hope you're having a happy weekend and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.